GT TV, and we're back. Was out with you. Now, I just seen an interview with Keith Thurman, and it was the most set up interview I've ever seen in my life. Go check it out. New Fox interview, Keith Thurman. It's a cast of three, and it's 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 really. Oh man, it was funny. It there was I couldn't believe that he had it set up like that. It was just so obvious, as you can see. So basically, this starts off. They ask Keith Thurman, as you can clearly see, he's wearing a cast on his arm. He's definitely trying to show something. So they have a little casual conversation about who everybody, who they are, and whatever's going on. They ask Keith Thurman one question, which segues into. Yeah, what's going into your what's going on with your arm? And then he's like, ah, nothing major. And just trying to fuse my bones together. Oh, oh, oh. And then she hits him with the question like, oh, oh. Oh, so when did this happen? You know, about a year and a half ago. Oh, oh. So this was before the Pacquiao fight. Yeah. Did, did it limit you in the making mini Pacquiao fight? Um. I just want to say that I had a great performance. I didn't have a good performance, but I plan to come to have a great performance after. Just tell us how much it limited you. Down 50%. <laughs> yeah. Back to you. Thank you for this. And it's like, why did y'all even, y'all set that whole thing up and put it out for Keith Thurman? Damn. I didn't think, oh, man. See, I always give people the benefit of the doubt the first time that he did this. The first time he did this when people were saying he was faking the, you know, there was there was speculation of Keith Thurman faking the uh, the car accident because he, he wanted some more time to prepare. And it looks like this is his, just his M.O. He, he, he has to make up something to continue his career rocking. And I mean, fuck it, that's what you got to do then. That's what you got to do. But, I mean, just don't make it obvious like that. You can't come out, like, everybody was happy the way he came out the first time after the fight. Humble. His voice was different. His vo Oh, man, that shit was weird to me, man. I'm usually, you know, you hear Keith Thurman loud and talking. Once I saw them after the fight, it was, yeah, you know, I got to pick myself up. Fight me. Fight me. And it was like. Damn, why is his voice so high, you know? And it's like, ah, oh, bro, you look crazy right now. But, you know, this is what boxing does. It exposes and it lets all the inner emotions will come out. And you will find out more of about a boxer the more you watch them fight. Because it's hard to hold all those emotions in at all times. Especially when the camera's on you at all times. You're going to slip and your real self going to come out. See, see.